Hello and welcome to tonight's Brutal Cast. Tonight we have Black Watch and Murphy's Maniacs. Let's see how these two teams do. So hang tight and we'll be back momentarily when the round begins. All right, and here we go. All right, and we're starting this round off real quick with Murphy's Maniacs on the vault. We've got a co-caster with us tonight, Ghost from Mayhem. Hello, hello. All right, so they did get the Far East spawn. I heard some, heard some quick peeks or quick shots coming up. Yeah, it sounds like Warren Waters pushed out to a spot where he's not looking for kills. He's looking to be the alarm for the for yeah. his teammates who may be in hospital or etc. to look out west whenever he hears footsteps. Blackwatch getting a fairly solid spread so far. Looks like they have maybe one guy heading out and maybe Reaper heading into the far northeast. He's gonna wrap around late game, but Oh, that was yeah, just a, a pre shot, a pre fire on from Jay Welch. Sneaky. Interesting positions. I do not like diabolic position there. Oh my. Uh, yeah, you don't. Are they coming up on? Cool. Okay, yeah, no, they're just. Looks they're like the they're. Phase. Yeah, they're setting up. They're setting up. I dig it. I dig it. It is pretty rough to attack this type of objective without getting any early picks. Okay, Strix giving some a bit of awareness, not knowing the yeah. one is there, but still. Yeah, well, he called out it. Nightshade, it sounded like. Nightshade Maybe, he said or building God. next to gas station. Oh, okay. Yeah, we were getting around. Do have. Nice yeah. I just saw but that. There, but there is a guy in three story who Reaper is not looking at. This yeah. could be a pick for Murphy's Maniacs here. Down your side of it. Got one of them, got one of them. Drex finds one. Yeah, yeah that's what I'm saying, Diabolic. Out. Yeah, that spot was not ideal. Oh, let's go over here. Reaper is on top of it. now oh, Ace Reaper, of Spades. I think Reaper knows he's there. Yeah. Or you don't look that, that intently at that building. Yeah. <laughs> Ace of spades dropping down. I don't know if he's trying to make a call, oh. but... Looks like Ace of spades is still... He's on the second floor there, looking for him. <clears throat> That's... There's one... 
all the way southeast, three story. Call outs coming out. Going in on the sneak. Warren finding Bishop. Oh, just crawling perfectly. <laughs> taking just pop missed. shots, taking pop shots. That onward timing. It is an even 4-4 match right now. Is he going to try to throw the smoke out of three-story? Yes, he did Ooh, and he do does. It. That's a game changer. So it. Mini oh. Sneak down here though. Oof. Mini, Mini sneak, sneak. He does get the pick. But well, not the me. quick refrag. <laughs> yeah, quick refrag. And Blackwatch running out of time here. I mean, 50 seconds on the clock, and they haven't even breached the West. I mean, yeah. this is pretty dangerous territory. Yeah, top recruit taking his time to get over here. They know of Warren Water's spot. Yeah, he did have a teammate die uh, just west of gas station there, so he's a little weary to peek out. He goes for it, though. Oh! He finds the pick. This is huge. This opens up the West. Yes, it does. With 30 Wide seconds open. remaining, though. Oh. Nightshade's looking for him. I don't think he's aware. Oh, my he gosh. He's just coming in. Cleaning house. But they are running out of time. Sneaky coming in. He has the angle to pick off Sneaky here. Oh. Ooh, great pick by Sneaky. With one second and remaining, Blackwatch runs out of time. Yep. Wow. Solid, solid gameplay for sure. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, I mean, Top X recruit there in the end, he he was able to open up the West. He just didn't do it in time. You know, you really have to get control of that West towards the end of the game. Yeah. Or, you know, towards in that second half, because then that gives you more time for your teammates to push in. Yeah, but, with those I mean, with with those flick skills, I mean, he, he could have made that push a whole lot earlier. Mm hmm. For sure. So, Murphy's Maniacs takes the first round of this scrim. You have any predictions on this? I know we had some in our little in our little pre-chat before the cast started. You wanna you wanna make that public, or you just wanna keep that to yourself? Uh, I mean, I think it's no like secret that when you're looking at Blackwatch's current roster that they have, they've had players that have played or are currently playing on master level teams. Yeah. And, uh, but from the looks of it, they are sitting back and letting the team, they're more right. of a body filling in instead of coming in and just cleaning house. It's more well, of a body. It's fitting. only been one round, so we yeah. can't tell it off too early, but yeah, yeah, more or less. Yeah, no, I mean, I think that if Murphy's maniacs could just yeah, hold their you defenses, have... Oh, look, we're about to start. Yeah, because they have both got one kill each. Shrix and Reaper. So, let's get back into the game. They got the Northeast spawn, so... Murphy's Maniacs can... Uh, there's an early line from the from Murphy's Maniac spawn where you can kill people crossing the Southeast Street. That would be huge if they yes. were able to see. Yep. It looks like one of them is running to the right direction. He's looking up a white car. Look across. You can see Bishop here. Oh man. Oh. More that more was a free kill. Yeah, free they kill. They identify, okay. A laser came over right there. Might have been an identification. Well, I don't think that was an identification. Reaper and Strix are pushing hard in the west. Strix pushing into when was seen on the plane wing. The now pushing into plane and Reaper. Make himself comfortable in the cockpit. Okay, yeah, they did call out Reaper and Bishop. Ace mm -hmm. of Spades was able to make that call out. Strix coming in yeah, loud we're here. Around them is, like, basically, we're going to play gas station. Man, yeah, but 
Good idea of getting around to gas station tricks though. It's gonna be really dangerous. If they don't see us, don't engage. Drake's using a little jump up to get onto impact, which is I believe yeah. is illegal. Yeah, he's, yeah, gonna, you can't, he's gonna kill you can't. three here. Three of them are flashed. Three of them are dead. Yep. Alpha less than uh I mean <laughs> I feel like he's played this game long enough. You yeah. should know that, at least in VRML, you can And in League, yeah, I'm about to say in League. Yeah, in League, <laughs> what he did is banned, but all right. I mean, honestly, that could that could open up the West, though. Shrik's getting really confident out in the Northwest. Oh, opening yeah. Opening up a little bit of movement, but Warren, Warren could push. Yeah, and Ace of Spades, I mean, there there's a time when you can push, and there's a time when you can stay back. If y'all are down to just a two-piece, it's time to reevaluate y'all's current situation. Yeah. Top recruit, not trying to duck or anything, just... Yeah, he's shadowed off. Strix is about to get another pick. And a trade. Oh, trade. Top recruit picks off Warren. On that west cross, that's so strange why Warren crossed at the West Hesco's. When, I mean, you had access straight to gas station. He was in the west, the southwest alley, he could just walk straight to gas station, but he went out. And he hugged this cross. Hugged yeah. that west cross, opening your, himself to hospital. Pretty similar objective. Yeah. Kinda. Few more little nooks and crannies mm -hmm. can hide in for sure. Boy, it's gonna be this is where finding those early lines and everything is super crucial. Right. I mean, if not, I mean, you're letting them own real estate danger close to objective. Yeah, if you do get that southern spawn as Marsock, you want to control hospital. Controlling hospital is pretty much a round winner. Yep. Or uh, anything east of objective, because, I mean, getting actually onto objective would be kind of hard if they still own gas station and they have a lot of firepower there. But right. if they have nothing east of objective, getting into the little alleyway next to it. Yeah. Let's switch over so they can see what we're talking about. Yeah, if they getting in this alleyway right here, that that's the number one spot that a lot of people, upper tier players, know. But and here we go, we got it. You get the south spawn. They got to take advantage of it. Now, who's gonna take advantage and go? It's like we have. Strix and J Welch yeah. running to the south. Recruit Reaper and Bishop taking uh, maybe crossing. The lines. He does not connect. And they have but... completely given up mm -hmm. hospital. Ooh. Rag coming out. Little, pretty short. Little sh yeah, pretty short. And it looks like GG Reaper, Reaper's I, gonna come in going, pretty hot, yeah. Yeah, he, I think he's going to cap here. Honestly, he has the line. Yep. He just needs a little bit more utility for teammates. Ooh, and a TK oh, from Night Shade, that's not gonna help. Shrek's yeah. finding Diabolic Outlaw, and this defense is falling apart. Reaper's coming Tablet in. out, tablet this, out. This is a cap. Let's go he's ahead and... <clears throat> quick quick match that's those early lines yeah and really taking control of your yeah. spawn you know I mean Shrix knew that if he got into hospital and started suppressing that 
Reaper was going to have enough opportunity, especially with some utility yep. on the objective, to get in there and send the cap. Yeah, clearing out, clearing out gas station and taking. I mean, this guy he could have been left as cannon fodder, and yeah. been the last one alive and still make the cap out here. If now pushed, if he goes to rotate out, yeah, drop him. But right, if they even pushed with call a guy into made, center burning. If Blackwatch pushed a guy into center burning and then looking back at objective through the second floor, he would have killed Reaper on his approach. But That's they just... kind of stayed solely west of the objective. I mean, what they had. Yep. They didn't put anybody eastward of the objective. Everything we just said, owning any portion of it east... Is, is key for this objective, and they completely let the east side go, and I even called out the cap location. Yeah, I mean, that round, I think that, yeah, I mean, they just needed to move. They didn't really get far from objective, and it looked like Warren Water that round was heading, like, far, like, while they were, the smoke was approaching, Reaper's approaching objective, he was in the west, like, flanking at, uh, airplane or something, which is just, yeah, I mean, if you're on the objective, you have to communicate with your team, saying, hey, there's smoke on, y'all need to come back. Yeah, crash, have that crash OBJ plan. That's yep. what I'm talking yeah, about, right watch. Watch for the cross, check and pre-spawn. Shrix getting that early line, trying to see. Not quick. Watch out for north, for uh, motel. Yep. So top recruit. <laughs> top recruit could get a pick here. Yeah. Because Blackwater playing bear exposed. Good pick. Great pick on the Shrix there on the roof. GT Reaper though. Oh, and just gets the down. Doesn't get the confirm. GT Reaper is crossing the South Middle Street. Top extra crew. Like we lost a one also. Bit of a situation here. They're getting the revives. Blackwatch need or Murphy's Maniacs needs to rotate out. You can't keep fighting this. Yeah, no. Nah. No, so they know where they're at. I mean, he just he was at that crack. He popped shots off, he rotated forward, which is good, but going back to the same angle and shoot again, that I like to shoot and rotate. Keep them guessing. Right, and Reaper here is on the flank, already at cargo containers. He's going to be a big thorn in, in Murphy's Maniac sides if he isn't dealt with. Who is that? Table. Uh, GT Reaper. Yep, okay, I'm on him now. Yep, this is about to clean house right here and end it look for... Up, look at how they are. Yeah. Missing all of his shots, though. He needs to get out. He needs to fight a different way. Yeah. Wow, really, really big missed opportunity there. Oh, he didn't even see everybody. He's calling out there was just two. Ace of Spades might pick him off here. Looks like... Oh, oh. nice utility. Yeah. Wait, is he going to frag yeah. Oh, I he thought he was going, about to. Really close there. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe a little reset on the that tablet. That flash is going to hit Ace of Spades. Nightshade. Support. Nope. Yeah, Ace oh, look at that. Oh, look at that spot Ace of Spades just picked up. Yep. Reaper knows he's there, but Reaper has no utility to fight. Yep. Maybe utilizing that frag. And as people are getting picks in the west, they're just, I mean, with Reaper away from objective like this. Is Reaper ready? Oh, I don't think Reaper's ready. I don't think Reaper's ready. J. Welch finding many sneaky. Oh. Oh. Oh, is he going to see the toes? The toes! Yep. yep. Reaper did oh, see the toes, and it went to a quick... 1v3 with Diabolic Outlaw in the wide open. He can get yep. double tap from the north and the south. Although oh. that being said, he does have a line onto objective. <laughs> yeah, he does. Well, there is a hole. he would have to run past top recruit and Jay Welch. So well, I'd... if he just like, if he beelines it straight to hospital here, 
like in Hugs Hospital Wall all the way to OBJ. And GT's making a GT. crazy long flank, expecting yep. a far uh, west push. But yeah, Jay Welch is Jay gonna Welch stop is gonna this. Get hit here. He might get hit here though. Okay, he might get. Welch. Yeah, he don't oh, have. He a... goes into cover. <laughs> oh, not focusing. Pick. Everybody's anticipating that west push. The Recruit, cap's open. Rotate, the bro. cap's open. The cap's open. Okay, recruits looking at it. Look, recruits looking at it. Gun up. Eh, gun no, up. Not gun up. If your eyes up, your guns up. There we go. There we go. There we go. Oh, oh, oh! And he's on objective. This tablet's out. Yeah, I can't touch the buttons. Ah, that time's gonna be off. So just ignore the time. Wow. What? Three, three. Stopped looking at him. Yeah. He had the line covered. He needed to wait for Reaper to come back. Wow. Oh, man. What a round. <laughs> What a round. What a round. I mean, I think... I mean, I don't know if he knew what he was doing, but he did the right thing where he was pinched with, I mean, the last shots he heard Reaper behind him on AC, so he had to block his way to that, so he went on the cockpit. Yeah. And then Reaper rotated west. Meanwhile, Jay Welch was exposed to that south street, so Diabolic was able to cross, get the pick on to him. And then all Recruiter had to do there was just look at objective. I mean, objective is top priority. He tried to, like, he's looking at it for a minute, and then he stopped. And in that brief moment that he stopped, Diabolic was able to cross. Yep. That onward timing. On, yeah. Onward timing. <laughs> Listen, I don't care what rank you are. Onward timing will get the best of you. <laughs> yeah. Master all the way to bronze. It happens to us all. Yeah. So, a little quick, giving up a lot for that flank, mm -hmm. I think, cost him a little bit. For sure. Uh, trying to go for kills rather than hold down the objective. Nah. And just a oh, note, reference, for, that was a... a uh, reset. Are they going for the round reset? You're going to be giving them the round. Oh, what are they doing? Oh, they don't even know what it means. Oh my gosh. Yep, it is too late. And now it is a 3v5. Yep, we thought that was going to be a round reset. Who is that? Oh boy. Yeah, Jay Welch is not going to be happy about that. Real quick on to... Let's get over here. We're worried about this. Dude, Meanwhile, they're coming yeah, up yeah. to get in their spots, and you've already got smoke on objective. Mm -hmm. That's when you start flipping out, and Reaper's going to take this Reaper's easy one right here. Cap right here. Yep. Rex gets the pick. Tablets the out. Little little hard time with the numbers. Yeah. Wow. Back to back to back caps. I mean, to be yeah. fair, okay, we won't really count. Three defenders come up. Yeah. Lots of confusion, but. Yep. Yeah, I mean. And that's the end of map number one. With Blackwatch taking five and Murphy's with three. Notes concluding. I've learned how to round reset. Yes. Just kill yourself with a knife or something. Or shoot yourself. They were on Volk, so they could have shot themselves. Easily. How about being a fly on that tent wall? What's going on, guys? Suburbia. Another little suburbia. I dig it.
Okay, so. And I don't know why I want to put Blackwater every time I type in that name. <laughs> so we have moved on to Suburbia. The only person I really noticed carrying a like a distance rifle was Ace of Spades. So I think both of these teams are pretty confident in their abilities with the uh, with the CQB. Yeah, I mean, we had in a previous round. I mean, Strix and GT Reaper they were getting pretty aggressive. And aggression works on yeah. Suburbia. It just does. Yep. And so it's it'll be curious to see if them two are just going to kind of go and control the center of the map and not really give the rest of their team a chance, or if they're going to try to play back and see how uh, Blackwatch defends themselves here. Yeah. I, I would have liked to have seen that last round play out. A solid five on five. Ugh. Any predictions for this one? Are you going with Black Watch because of the aggressive pushes? Aggressive pushes and, uh, I mean, players that are known for CQB. Yeah. But, I mean... I'm more than welcome to be wrong. <laughs> Absolutely. It's always it puts the the humanity into casters. We could be wrong too sometimes. So this objective, we are in center house second story uplink. This is one of those this is one of those uplinks that I just my goal is to take out the team. Unless you know, you know, like totality of circumstances, totality of circumstances. If if you have flankers, people pushing out, and I've dropped everybody inside, oh, I'm going for cap. But, yeah, I mean, it is a dual edged sword. You can yeah. have either, you know, it's either you take the wide lane one or lane four approach, and you just try to take out the team, or you just blitz straight to the center, kill the guys on objective, and cap within the first thirty seconds. I mean, yeah, either or can happen. <laughs> All right, so we do have everybody here. And everybody's shooting at each other. Yep. All right, let's get back to it. Here we go. These maniacs going for a wide lane four approach. It's a three. And what was that noise? What? I don't know. I thought I was in. I heard bring. I don't know. It was like. Uh... Oh, uh, maybe the wind chimes. I think there's wind chimes. I don't know. It sounded like one of those TikTok things my son watches. Ooh, great pick, Nightshade. Oh yeah. One down. Strix Ooh, is holy. also pushed out in the lane one region. Expecting those, anticipating that aggression. Strix to take out Diabolic Outlaw. Oh, but he is... He he did take a stim pack. Mm-hmm. He could play time here. Or if Nightshade could play time here, it might work out for him. But I don't think it's going to be the case. Oh! Strix hits a lot of the wall. Looks like that's a is that gonna... Oh, oh yeah! I didn't know that could go down like through that. Through the fence. <laughs> And it full killed him too. Yeah. Well, he had already taken that stim pack. Right. Oh, we got a strong. Oh, I mean, yeah. Whoa. And that's why you don't stack up together there. I mean, I don't know how they let offense do that. And Jay Welch. We lost two of them in the backyard. They... I don't know why they're trying to force a back house approach either. I mean, it's center house objective. Yeah, but that's a good defense, uh, like a defensive. Offense, I guess you could say. If if you Maybe. can own that house, you're not. 
because trying to push the angle that they're pushing, they've got to hold an angle 180 degrees from each other. You got to hold north and south simultaneously. They will try to swing on the nice shit here. It's a lot of noise. Nope. And then Jay, which is going to swing on a nice shit. He didn't hear the shots. Oh. Got a little, got a little tied up on that one with the fingers. <laughs> but Bishop was just down, making callouts up here. So. Yeah, I think that if Blockwatch opted to not push as close as they did to that back house, I mean, yeah, I mean they were just. It's kind of mind-boggling how they got there. <laughs> like, they just walked lane four and not a soul was covering it until they were it practically in the Volk spawn. Yeah. But with Nightshade being able to adapt like that, that really... I mean, it wasn't... It helped out a lot. It helped that match go longer than what it did. Or longer than what it could have been. Because if they would have pushed through, they would have came through and wiped up from the north side of uh, lane four, for sure. And also, it looked like they used an M203 smoke from that, like, uh, APC, and they hit center house second floor. But in reality, if, you, if they were playing playground... Or something, and then they use that on the back house, on the back Volk house, and then they just push center. I mean, it's just strange that... Just strange push, strange push. Yeah. Now, Blackwatch on defense previous round, they... Uh, Shrix and Drew Reaper are playing pretty aggressive going for the cap, and I wonder if we're going to be seeing that again. I also want to see if we're going to be seeing any pre-fires. Yeah, I think it's pretty much dead after the update. Well, there we go. Nope. No, it ain't. It's more difficult, I will say that. Mm -hmm. The smokes are coming in. But this defense is ready, I mean. Yes. They're oh, yeah. Here. They're, they're coming to own this house. Oh, but Shrix is running in. Oh, so is picks. Reaper. Look at that. Oh, no, he burned himself with a Molotov. Oh. And, uh, and that is... was one. Nightshade. <laughs> this is when Nightshade needs to just hunker down and not focus on anything else but that main doorway. That's the angle he needs to be watching. Right now, Jay Welch could come in and clean house. Yeah, I mean, cap is open. Yeah. yeah. He's going to check his tablet here, freak out, run to objective, and then he's going to die. I would stay right here watching that hallway. Just suck all the way to the back of this wall and watch that doorway. Actually, I like to be downstairs in the garage. Yeah. But also think about it from the west of, from the rest of Blackwatch's position here. There they, were no kill counts being made. Yeah, none. You know, so they have no idea how many defenders are alive. And yeah, Jay Welch. Locks that <laughs> yeah, one down. <laughs> Man, savagery. Brutal. I mean, Shrix and Reaper just push in there and wipe out three of the four players. And then mistakes were made on that last kill. <laughs> On yeah, that last it's, death. It's, yeah. <laughs> it happens. It happens. It does. It does. Especially when you're in that chaos. You know, you just had your entire team just get blown to pieces in front of you. And you have no idea how many more are coming along. So, yeah. Oh, in look. his eyes in that moment, he was probably like, oh, well, I'm dead. But maybe it'll stop the rest from pushing. But in reality, no one else is there. They're requesting, they're requesting some boat wreck action. Oh, yeah? Let's get Boat Wreck in here. Yeah, one minute. All right.
and we're back. All right. So, different objective. Yeah, complete other side of the map. Yeah. So, what's up, boat wreck? How you doing? Good. They're asking about you. Watch that pre-fire. Nobody's pushing up on slide. Speaking of push, I mean, I'm guessing this is Reaper and Tricks again in the lane one. Ooh, a lot of lasers. They are all over center house. This could be a pick right here. Peeking the wide. Reaper is not fine. Ooh, they ooped at him. Oh, Red, did you see that? One main shade. Trying to get that angle. Trying to get that peak underneath that truck. Oh, just missing them. That's onward timing, huh, dude? They can't Tricks hear your head shake, bro. Shade. Yeah, this is super dangerous for, Bla or for Murphy's Maniacs right now. Yeah. They know where Black they're watch. at, and they're about to start rotating and collapsing in on Murphy's Maniacs' position. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Preeper going wide. Tricks. Looking like he's going to join him as well. We gotta push that yeah, warm water is rotating out. He's gonna get hit here. Shrek's finding Ace of Spades. P90ing Reaper. Come on, one more on your flank, one more. Yeah, watching out for those flanks. Shrek's is anticipating this. Oh. Yep. Now mini sneaky. Oh. Shots. So what's so the thing about Reaper. that boat wreck? <laughs> yeah. So we do got another guest co-caster. Say what's up, dude. What's up? Is it your name's Boat Wreck? Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's your gamer tag. Guess who's on here with us? Ghost. What up, Boat Wreck? How you been? Here, listen to him. Oh, yeah, you probably can't hear me through the headset. Now he can hear you. <laughs> what up, Bo-Rack? Can you hear me now? Yeah. Yeah. How you doing, man? What are you thinking about this gameplay that's going on here? Who do you think is going to win? The blue team or the red team? Black the blue Watch team. or Murphy's Maniacs? The blue team. So that's blue Black team. Watch? Yeah. yeah. I mean... His prediction is pretty good so far. Yeah. Black watch on game point here. Yes, this is game point. So if they win one more. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Let's switch back to the game. Let's see how much action we can get going on. So. Fuck you, Baltimore. Where, where do you or do you think they're gonna get the objective and send the send the uplink or yeah you gotta you gotta say yes yes smoke is coming All right out. the word has been spoken GT Reaper downing one with the frag M203 smokes are on objective oh Shrek's pushing right behind Ace of Spades GT Reaper finding yeah, sneaky dude. oh picks him up. Look, you want to hit that one? Hit that button, dude. Reaper's going in for the cap. <laughs> Got him! Oh. Now press that button. Press it. And they get the cap. Yeah, I didn't. That timer wasn't. I had a little finger in the way. <laughs> so. Man, but we're pretty good at predicting. Win. And that's the end of map number two now. I gotta say, master level prediction from Boat Wreck there, saying they're gonna send the uplink, lo and behold. Yeah. Maybe you can be, like, recruited by, like, Mayhem or something, dude. Yeah. Among Us. <laughs> I don't know if they play Among Us or not. So. Alright. So. Your your team did win that you predicted. So what what's next? 
I don't know. Yeah, who is that in the chat? Connor? Yeah, this match would be a whole lot different if Shrix and Reaper were not there. For sure, 100%. I mean, to be fair, it is 1-1. One, one. They did lose the first map, so... Yeah. And uh, Blackwatch are identifying that, hey, we were able to win a big map against a against these players, so let's try yeah. it again. And so they're taking, us to, taking them to downfall. Ace of Spades, you're going to be pulling out that 12x again, I bet. And now we're on to my favorite map. You like this map too, dude? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. All right, let me see this. All right, I got my headphones back. All right. Thanks, Boat Wreck, for coming in. Tell everybody goodbye. Bye. All right. They requested it in the chat, so we had to make it happen. That was Boat Wreck. My little mini-me. Yeah, you All can't right. quite, you can't, he doesn't quite have your accent yet, but once he gets a little bit older, I think he's gonna. Oh yeah, gonna be like a micro game. Theo Vaughn. <laughs> and he likes pressing buttons on my stream deck so <laughs> sorry we missed that cap but I'm pretty sure GT has plenty of cap footages of himself oh, yeah. so on this map it's key to get that spawn identification right off the rip or try to uh Murphy's Maniac sending a guy into the hills. Does he make it? He doesn't. N no, he does not. That's risky, risky, risky. Uh, risky for sure. But the rest of the defense is able to get to their positions. Reaper running right down in the middle of the map. Can run right into Ace of Spades. He isn't careful. Oh, but Reaper has spotted him. Ace of Spades, don't get too peaky here. You're in the most powerful building on this map if you play it right. Yeah, Mini Sneaky could. He may have a, a line on Reaper if he's checking him out. Uh, yeah, Reaper's got to make these callouts here. I mean. Yeah. Communicate. Yeah. That, I mean, call out, if callouts could have been made, that would have been three locations. Mini, Diabolical, yeah. and Ace of Spades. All given up. Now it's a mystery. Like, we heard gunshots, but we don't know where they came from. So. Alright. Someone's having oh, calibration just... issues. <laughs> yeah, I heard that. These maniacs just need to... They just need to find some spots to tuck in at. I mean, you've gotten a pick, and they've already thrown a lot of util. At least two smokes that I've seen so far, so... Yeah. And it's an even 4-4 four, four right now. Bishop oh! Again. Gonna get spotted by Ace of Spades. But, okay, identify lower red. Hey, yeah. sneaky. Someone shot me over. from the middle of the map, like, uh, one of the center bungalows. Oh, he's calling out center bungalow. His oh, teammates in there. I think he saw him. Oh, Ace. Good pick. Did get recruit. Yep. From a Recruit bad call out. out. So. I mean, well, right there, Bishop called out. I just shot one and uh, he got he or he called out. He got shot from one of the center bungalows. So if right, top but... recruit is rotating around to get that kill, that that opens them up for Mesa Spades when there really wasn't a guy there. It's strange that the Blackwatch got the south spawn and yet nobody went Valley. I mean, they all opted to just rotate north, which I think was the best of options here. I mean, yeah. it, I mean, it still has plenty of time to work out for them, especially as they give them more ground to the north. Yeah, that I was mean, a Shrek's that was a pretty good. Yeah, that was a pretty good play on the eyes for Ace. 
Uh, Honestly, getting... I'd say that now that Shrek is over here past cratering, as soon as he gets to the tower, I'm pretty sure this round is going to be over unless yeah. he misses his shots. Yeah, because uh, actually he don't even have to go into tower, and he can take out Diabolical. Yep, Diabolical right here. Oh. Waiting for the peak. Diabolical is going to get shot right here. There Work it double. is. Ace of Spades did find ah! damage though. It's a freebie too. Got him! Ah! Oh, but Nightshade. OBJ is open. Well, yeah, because Ace of Spades lost discipline. He is the only thing stopping uh, Bishop from pushing in from the north. Like, Bishop could rotate around from Hilo. Well, could have. Here he goes to push in. He gets the pick. Great pick. Yeah, he just yeah, rotated out. Ace of Spades needs to come back into objective. Look at this bravery. Yep. He has yeah, no idea. He has footsteps. Great work. Got him. Great work for the defense. Yeah, absolutely. Murphy's Maniacs takes a win. Yeah, knowing knowing the map, I mean, I've played, I've I've been playing onward for a while, so there's a lot of maps that if I get shot from a location or just hear the gunshots, I'm pretty accurate on telling them where where those what building those shots came from. Yeah, and also, um, who was it that got shot at? Bishop got shot at and called us Bishop, for bungalows, Yeah, right? Bishop got shot at from Ace of Spades from Center Hotel at well, Lower Dumpster. Is, if Reaper called out Ace of Spades, then he probably would have connected in his brain that if he got shot at, it was probably from Center Hotel. Yeah. But Reaper didn't call that out. And Recruit thinking, hey, there's someone in one of my buildings that just took one of my teammates out. I'm gonna rotate out on him and get the get the kill. And because of that bad call out, Ace was able to make that happen. Oh look, they're talking mayhem among us pro team confirmed. Yeah, I saw that. <laughs> a lot of a lot of boat wreck fans out there. <laughs> All right, let's see if Black Watch, how much, are they going to actually focus on objective or are they going to rotate out and uh, come down? Look at, but, how many, look at how many are opting to go to the north side. Yeah. I mean, you have Reaper and Bishop. If they know the if Black Watch, or if Murphy you know the quick spawn, this could be an easy two piece right here. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. They don't take advantage of it. Yeah, though. not taking advantage of those quick peaks. I mean, you could easily drop that down to a 5v3 right there on that quick oh, line. But this, this is a kill. No one is taking advantage of this. Yeah, wow. nothing. Oh, drone in the air. Drone. And it goes down. And it goes down. <laughs> And Reaper not firing a shot at it, so his position still concealed. Ace. Good pick. It's just a down. Let's see. Oh. They do not know what they. He does not know what he's shooting at. He was making callouts. Reaper he called out a. Uh... Okay, Reaper. Yeah. Okay. Good pick. Diabolical. Finding a headshot of the tricks. Reaper now looking for him up over in the North Hotel region. Oh, whiffing nice those hand. shots. Oh! oh. <laughs> Got him! <laughs> That's going to tickle. Let's go. Let's get it. Let's get it. North Hotel. Honestly, I don't like North, Ho North Hotel as with, I mean... Not not as not as a push. Not as a push. No, not as a push. That's that's uh the forbidden the forbidden room is located in here for a reason. Because once you get there you're pretty much stuck. Alright, so they are waiting on nightshade. But nightshade 
looking like he's just gonna post up and watch out on Dr. Red. On downfall, you have to constant if like you have to constantly be moving on downfall if yeah. you are not sniping or if you Especially right with these new hard. five minute times. Mm hmm I mean back in season like eleven and all that when we had five minute time limits, I mean we were making work happen <laughs> in five minutes. Well, also think about it, though. Back in Season 11, five minutes, we also were so much faster in the old version. Oh, yeah. And now that you're slower, you have to double, work on double time. See, that's a, that's a big, like, no-no for me. They don't... They know where you're at, but they don't know exactly where you're at. Throwing that smoke just to mask a push, all it is really doing is telling people... That's where they are. They're moving from point A to point B. So now we know where the bad guys are. Bishop, In my opinion. He's looking at this here, though. Another smoke out in that direction. Might be to try to help Nightshade with Jay Welch. Might yeah, as a it. distraction. But I'm not seeing that many yellow lasers out. I mean, eyes up, guns up. There we go. Jay Welch picks up Nightshade. Get in the tower, get in the tower. Oh, they are Special not getting in tower. They find top recruit on objective. They need to react to this. Yeah, Jay Welch. Oh! The what are you doing? Jeez. That's down to a 1v2. Yep. And he is stuck in North Hotel. Yeah. Yeah, because now the defense is looking this way. Jay Welch is oh, rotating. Oh, Jay Welch is objective. rotating. Honestly, this is still pretty winnable for... Yeah, Warren. oh He's yeah. If he goes inside... Oh, he oh, found Bishop. He right found there. Bishop. He found Bishop. I don't know if he saw him, though. I don't know if Bishop saw Warren. He's about to. Right there. No, he's not. He's looking the other way. He's looking towards objective. Yeah, 44 seconds. Oh, onward timing. Yeah, Blackwatch, Blackwatch losing discipline. Jay Welch just rotating all over the place. Yeah, he's going all the way to Center Hotel. 30 seconds left. Yeah. Oh, TK! Emotional damage! That's why you don't rotate there. I'm just saying. Every, everybody else is gonna. Now, Warren, all he has to do is take out Bishop. He doesn't have the time and he's going no. too slow. Yeah, time management. Throw a frag in there. One no, second, no nope. No time, no time. Blackwatch wins it. Oh boy. I mean, Bishop gave that round to Murphy's yeah. Maniacs there with the team kill. But yep. Just lack of... This is, like, the one objective I want to suck start my pistol when I'm the last object when I'm the last defender on it. When I have to defend this objective by myself, it's... Oh. Yeah, it's not an ideal position. As for that objective, pretty especially, you can't sit still and yeah. defend it. You have to yeah, constantly no. check inside and then just. Now this one, on the other hand. Yeah, this is. Gotta... This one's a pretty gnarly objective. Will quick spawn be happening? No. It does not. This is actually the the bad spawn for the attack. So, Murphy's Manix have the opportunity to get a strong defense. Set yeah. up. Boys. All right, here we go. That drone is going to be huge. Yeah, it is. Let's try to Topic get some drone footage. Already. That's nice man shots. Oh, oh they are going to be calling out uh, Ace of Spades. 
And that drone is so high in the sky they yeah. can't hear it buzzing. Yep. I lost the drone. I can't even hear it buzzing anymore. Okay, let's get back in this fight, shall we? Oh, sorry about that. Jaylon's getting around in the west. This is what you want to see. Yeah. This is what. This is like the ideal attack. You get around the west. I mean, you encircle. Yep. Oh, duck. Know those peaks. you got yeah you're you're standing in front of north brothel yeah. if this guy peeks again he could pick him here get the pick get the pick get oh the pick. good pick yeah it was you gotta you gotta know those angles you gotta know they're getting where... really close onto upper dumpster oh no sorry just right yeah right. oh it's is... valley yeah ace of spades if he does one quick peek maybe Waiting for footsteps. Yeah. Footsteps. Sneaky. Spades. Spades. He's on you, bud. Too late yep, now. Out of time, bro. He knows where you are. Maybe he's just gonna pray one of his teammates watch. Yep. Okay. I mean, making yep. it known. Yeah, making it known. Do we got any lasers pointing this way? know about this window he could be peeking through and... I mean it's kind of good on him that he's not peeking it yeah but... oh oh he's I didn't know if he was exposing himself to that other window he is outgunned at this moment so oh he he gets tricks here he doesn't Your mama. tricks is little 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 banner. Tricks make the noise so Bishop can run up onto him. Yep. Look, teammates. There teammates, you go. Look at White House. Oh my God. They're focused on that north. <sighs> They're splitting their defenses. Where'd you get shot at right now? is gonna get picked off by Shrek's here. He yep. goes for one more peek. He's dead. Oh. He sees him. There he goes. Yep. There he goes. The north is open. The no north. Yeah, north is open for the cap. Nightshade is here. Oh no, he's. Oh! oh my goodness, Nightshade! What are you doing? Oh, my timer's jacked. Check objective. Oh, what? What? Look at that. Yeah. Jeez. Black Watch coming in with the cap, bringing it to a 3-1. That is, that is rough. Hey, Ghost, I think Murphy's need a sub. You want to go help him out? Do they? Get another master. No, I'm just jacking with you. <laughs> Do they? Dude, I'll, I'll go. Dude, on downfall, I'll go. Fuck them up six days from Sunday. <laughs> okay, rival. Oh, my bad. <laughs> Did you just get a 20 from rival for that? Maybe. <laughs> I better. Now, see, now, see, now I'm going to go over there and be like, hey. You owe me 20 bucks, bro. Yeah. <laughs> All right. This could very well be the last match played for tonight. We shall see. Uh, but, I mean, Murphy's has... They have they've put up a fight. They've held their own. Mm-hmm. For sure. Uh. It's pretty uh. Same spawns. Yep. Look at them all checking if it's quick spawn. <laughs> uh. 
Okay, so let's get into it. Same villa spawn. A little bit different, uh... Extra crew. A little oh, different. Staying on objective. Yeah. That's... I would like to see at least two on objective. One on front, one on back. Because if if someone gets pinched... Ooh. <laughs> oh. What a shot. Was that on the fly, too? Yeah. Money. Strix. Strix coming out to the side here. Oh, look. GT Reapers Ooh. down. Two down, two down, two down. But they haven't identified that a teammate just died from the north side of Bungalow. Oh, in this valley. This is going to be a two-piece right here. Nope. Ace what recognizing those shots. Somewhere in the center. I'm not too sure where. Oh. Bishop didn't see him. Bishop did not see him. He's about to see him right here. Or not. What's happening? Yeah, letting Shrek see the north center of Bungalow is yeah. just a... Yeah, that's that power, power defense play. Yeah, that power position. <clears throat> and the last guy is still up in North Hotel. Uh, Shrix is going to have this guy pinned. There is no way out from Shrix. North Hotel is over there. What are you talking about? Little, little... Yeah, Calm. I'm over here dealing with them. I'm here in the center bungalow. Yeah. It's not looking good for Murphy's Maniacs at all. Uh, y'all deal with stable. Let me deal with North Hotel. Trax is saying, let me deal with North Hotel. Yeah. Even though if he does rotate... Okay, no, no, there's North, one North Hotel. Last one's stable. Who's gonna get this? Oh! Emotional damage. There's some Yikes. explicit language being shouted right now in the tent. Mm -hmm. And now all of a sudden, this round is actually winnable for. Yeah, absolutely. Well, I, if they get the revive onto Jay Welch here, yeah. actually, then it's gonna be hook, line, and sinker. But yep, they're gonna get that revive. Yep. Oh. If he's not ready, he's peeking. He could see it. Yep, oh, he gone. did see it. He saw the revive. He knows. Oh, don't expose yourself. Oh, don't looking, expose yeah. yourself. This is when he needs to rotate. Rotate out. And Black Watch wins this round. Oh, that's a rough one for the maniacs. But I, if I was a, if I was a maniac right now, my head would be high. I mean, we just went oh, yeah. against another team that had two subs coming in, master subs, and we held our own like that. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. sure. Uh. I don't, I don't know if this is normally Blackwatch's standard uh, play style. Being aggressive as what Shrix and Reaper were doing. Uh, definitely not. I mean, <laughs> Suburbia, Suburbia Center House when Reaper and Shrix were on the objective on that center house. You know, they pushed straight to the objective and yet the remaining three, Jay Welch, uh, Recruit, and Bishop, they still they stayed back and they played it slow and they. Yeah. You know. Yeah, they they played it pretty slow that first round, and then after that, it, it just went like, okay, we're gonna flank everything. Yeah. Yeah, I definitely would have liked to see more of. I mean, if you're a master level player going in and reserving for a team that is a lower level, that you need to understand play, that like, play on their level. Yeah, play on their level. Don't just push everything. Yep. Try and... Especially, know. I mean, it's a scrim. They're there to... I mean, they are learning from you. But if you're doing all the work, they're, they're not going through those motions. Mm -hmm. It's a scrim right before the season starts, too. Yeah. So it's like, they're this, this is what's going to be fresh in their mind going into the season. And yeah. when they try to replicate those same push-outs, they don't have the same skill. They're going to get dropped. Correct. Absolutely. Absolutely. Uh, 
So, yeah. Uh, keep your head up, Maniacs. Y'all did good. I, I was I was impressed. Y'all had those on, even against those two master players. Black Watch, they still had a lot of solid plays separated from Reaper and uh, Sh Shrix. And uh, they, they made some solid plays. There were a few errors. Uh, I think uh, Top Recruit. He's a he's Top a pros recruit. yeah he was a prospect so I mean a little sync up so the the TK that that TK and getting capped on that was yeah I mean just that's just kind of game I I would though, be more focused on the cap rather than the the TK TK comes with syncing with your team knowing where those guys are uh, a lot of teams don't pre-brief like we used to do where we would map everything out after a week long study <laughs> and yeah. Intel maps and all this. So everybody knew exactly everybody's position. So we didn't have those TK issues coming into well, this. We <laughs> did, but not, not that many on offense, not on defense. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but, uh, but yeah, being in those like off meta spots that they're not used to people playing, they see movement. From a distance, hey, I'm taking the shot too. I mean, I would right. try to communicate. Hey, anybody here? There was communication, so it could have been avoided. But I don't. If if I was grading him as a as a prospect, I wouldn't take that. I'd be like, yeah, you just need to trigger discipline, listen to the comms, and stuff like that. But I'd be more yeah, focused he's... on being capped on. I mean, he's still a solid player, solid, uh, a lot of good plays. Yeah, he definitely has a lot of room for improvement. Yeah, yeah. He has some really good flicks on uh, quarantine for sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah, <laughs> uh, I mean, if they just worked better on their time there mm -hmm. that round, I mean, he saved that. If there was just a little bit more time, he would have saved yeah. that round. But but that's flicks. that's going to be the biggest hurdle coming into this new VRML season is, is the time. Up. Yeah, five minutes. Yeah. A, a lot of these players have never had a five-minute match. What Mayhem has been trying to do to combat that is we'll play as if there's only three minutes. Yep. And so it lets us just get super aggressive getting to certain places, the setup phase, rotation phase, and then play, you know, get the picks. Yeah. We getting trade secrets from Mayhem? Yeah. I feel like if anyone <laughs> is getting trade secrets, it's going to be you guys. No, it's not Roger really trade that. secrets. You watch one cast, it's pretty easy to pick up on. And if you well, don't... You need well, to you need to talk to James because y'all got a prospect here at my house, little boat wreck. Yeah, little boat he, wreck man. He wants to start that Among Us pro team. <laughs> <laughs> Turn him up. God, dude, playing Among Us with James, Ugh. that's too many mind games. I don't want to deal with that. <laughs> All right, well, thanks for tuning in. If you haven't done so already, like and subscribe to the channel. Follow us on Discord. The link is in the bio and in the description of this video. If y'all want to be casted, hit us up in the Discord, and we'll make it happen. Uh, it is coming into the VRML season, so I want to wish everybody a good luck in their upcoming seasons. Uh, I will be dedicating a lot of my time to the VRML casts. Uh, but if I do have time, I'll still be hitting up these brutal casts and everything else like that. Maybe get rival and blocks and here's some more. I don't know what their schedules are looking like during this season, but I know, I guess Mayhem keeps you pretty busy, huh? A little bit, yeah. Yeah, so. May may lose you during the season. <laughs> yeah, for sure. I mean, early season, I mean, I'll still be around plenty. Yeah. Doesn't mean it's early season. It doesn't really matter too much, to be honest. But then late season, when I got to focus up, then yeah. Yeah. And be, be sure to, to follow us on there because uh, we have VRML Con coming up. Thinking about making a guest appearance. If so, I may do like swag giveaways up there. That'd be kind of legit. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe get some stickers. Oh, yeah. Some I, brutal cast stickers. Yeah, I still got some of our antique violence of action stickers. Yeah. Actually, I have, I have you have one, one on your... Uh, one on my headset. headset. <laughs> yeah. One on my headset, and then I have one sticker uh, on my... I had it on my computer, but 
It started getting old, so I took it off. But. Yeah. So, all right. Well, y'all be sure to hit us up. Uh, thanks for tuning in and watching and keeping the chat lively. So, y'all be good. Until next time.